This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. All right, so we're talking about Drake. Drake is in a love triangle, it seems, with... Uh, it's a, it's a weird love triangle because he's been attached to Julia Fox in the past, okay? In 2020, he didn't go public with her, but they went to the mansion. He flew her out to the mansion, and he got her two Birkin bags. So it wasn't just... It wasn't just a fling, okay? This was something where he was considering maybe, you know, taking this to another level. Now, she did put out there that, well, she said, I've been with billionaires before. Obviously, Drake's not a billionaire, but she probably meant it like, I've been with rich people before. This is nothing new to me, but let's be honest. She's out for the cliz out, okay? She wants the follow. She wants the to be attached to the big names. So she gets the big jobs, okay? Obviously, she's a model. But what's really weird is there's a whole nother third wheel to this. Pete Davidson, the guy who's smashing Kim Kardashian right now. Kanye West's wife, soon to be ex, right? Kanye, I mean, Kim's done, you know? Uh, Kanye is out here just trying to cover up the, the hurt. I mean, let's be honest. I, I, I know... I don't know what it feels like with a wife, but I know what it feels like with a girlfriend or something to lose them. And then, you know, there was somebody else, you know, and then you got to see it, right now. It's trash. You know, we've all been through that before. And, you know, Kim has totally moved on. You know, Kanye could have saved the relationship a long time ago and didn't make the effort. You know, there's some things in this world that are just worth more than advancing, you know? Like, uh, I'm not saying he should have taken a back seat to it, but there was a, t I mean, he already had the success with Yeezy and was still obviously good with Kim. They were still having babies. She was still going to the concerts and everything. But there was a point where he like tripled down and started going to Wyoming and telling the family they're gonna move to like Chicago. It was just very erratic stuff that was affecting her business. And I think at one point, she was just done with it, you know? Um, and I don't know what the Pete Davidson thing is because it's a little bit odd, you know? I don't know if it's for the TV show or whatever, but he's linked with Julia too. They had like a little photo shoot together and uh, who knows what happened after that. Maybe they maybe they had a little romance, who knows? But it's this, you know, Kanye's trying to cover it up and he's acting a little out of pocket, but you know, he's out of, it's not, it's a it's human nature to to uh try to cover up the bruises you know and that's what he's doing right now you know emotional bruises it hurts love hurts man it does um especially when you have a family and kids and you want that family unit and he i think he feels like that you know he lost something major i think that him and kim will come back together you know but it's gonna take some time you know because i think they really in the end of the day they complement each other you know as far as like you know both wanting the attention and everything else and advancing and work ethic but kanye's just got to settle down a little bit more with like you know these ideas where he just jumps out the window and uh you know so we're moving to chicago tomorrow you know when you got four kids that's not going to work with the mother um and you can't just move kids around like that. Drake linking to her, that was more of a secret thing that got revealed. Obviously, it was a secret because he brought her into the mansion, the gates. Nobody saw anything, just rumors. Anyways, what do you guys think about this weird love triangle? It's very spooky out here. Everybody seems to be sharing the same people, and it's crazy. It's Jordan Tower with JT News. Smash that like button like Kanye is smashing Julia. And Pete Davidson is smashing Kim. Peace.